Hey, I'm Srini. I'm the host and co-founder of Blogcast FM, and today I am really excited to bring you part one of this five-part video series on relationship marketing for bloggers. So let's get to it. Your very first reader really can be a lifeline to your digital world. If you're a new blogger and you only have a couple of comments on your blog and you think, ah, I'm kind of hearing crickets chirping, this is really not a big deal, you'd be amazed what can actually happen if you go out and you start to build relationships with those people. So what I want to talk about today is three simple ways that you can start to build relationships with those very first readers and basically leverage them to grow your own network online. So let's talk about the very first one. It might sound simple, but it's actually very effective. Visit their blog and send them an email, letting them know that you really appreciate the fact that they came to visit your site. Now, the reason this works so well is because it takes effort, and it shows that you actually really care, and it's very genuine. The other reason is that it can lead to a lot of other things. That first email can be just a starting conversation that could lead to you getting hired to do work with this person. It could lead to you guys creating content together. It could lead to you guys creating products together. That could be the very beginning of a lot of other things. The other simple thing that you can do is leave a comment. They have left a comment on your blog, you go and leave a comment on theirs. Now, it seems very simple, but over time it has a very profound effect or a powerful effect. So it's just reciprocation at work. And then finally, there's one really simple thing, and this is something you probably know already, but it actually works really well. Share one of their posts. Share it on Facebook, share it on Twitter, share it on Google+, share it across any social network. And you do this enough times, and it also will have an effect. Now, you might be thinking to yourself, yes, this is all great, it's all very simple, but does it really work? Well, here's the thing. I'm going to give you one piece of advice that will make it a thousand times more effective. Over the next 10 days, I want you to go to 15 early stage bloggers, people who are up and coming or people who have just gotten started. Now, the reason I'm telling you to go to early stage bloggers is this. These concepts won't work as well with somebody who's really well known because they're inundated with people trying to get their attention. But imagine if you did this for 15 early stage bloggers. If you emailed one, commented on one person's blog, and shared one of their posts, by the end of this week, you'd have 15 new connections that you didn't have before. And the beautiful part is that you'll actually be tied into their networks. And tomorrow, on part two of the series, we'll talk about the power of compounding relationships and how this becomes incredibly powerful over time. It's everything that I've used to build Blogcast FM to what it is today. And tomorrow, I'm going to share those concepts with you. If you're interested in a more in-depth explanation of all these concepts, you can pick up my copy of Relationship Marketing for Bloggers, and I've included a link below in the show notes. So tune in tomorrow for part two, and I'm looking forward to seeing you then.